Now, Mr. Van Cleve, I'm sorry to wake you up, but it has to be done. No, if I could just sit sit in those people say it. Uh now open your mouth, please. Oh, go away, go away, and leave me alone. What was that dream all about? Oh, I was having such a good time. Just open your mouth. What was that all about? Oh, yes. The door opened, and a man stepped out of a rowboat. He said, Henry, I've come to take you on a trip from which you'll never come back. Now, please, don't get excited. And I said, my good fellow, if I ever take a trip like that, it'll be in a deluxe cabin and not in a dinky little rowboat that doesn't even have a bar. So I threw him out, rowboat and all. Good, good. And what do you think he did? He came back with a big luxury liner floating on an ocean of whiskey and soda. And instead of funnels, there were big black cigars. And on top of the bar, sitting in a lifeboat, was the most beautiful blonde wearing a Mary Widow costume. She dived into the whiskey and swam right over to my bedside. Henry, she said, how about a little dance? And the man from the boat took an accordion out of his pocket and he played the Mary Widow waltz. The girl held her arms out to me and she started to dance. Well, with him playing and her dancing and me up to my neck in whiskey anyhow. Well, I put my arms around that beautiful girl and was just about to dance with her when of all people you cut in. You, yes, you. Just open your mouth. Oh, go away and take that thermometer with you. Oh. Night nurse has just arrived. All right. Good evening. Hello. First door to the right. Thank you. <laughs> 